Hello everyone, welcome to day 12th of October League Code Challenge and today's question is Guess number higher or lower In this question we are playing the guess game The game is as follows I pick a number from 1 to n, both inclusive You have to guess which number I picked And every time you make a wrong guess I will tell you whether the number picked is higher or lower than your guess And what is the interface for telling you this information that your number is higher or lower than the guess there is a predefined api for this named guess it accepts in a number if the number that i picked is lower than the guess then i'll then this api will return minus one if it is higher than your guess then it will return one if it is equal to your guess then it will return zero we need to return the number that has been picked seems like a pretty easy question quite understandable now let's talk about how can we solve this question so let's move on to the ppt guess number higher or lower lead code 374 it's an it's an easy level question on lead code however if you're using binary search for the very first time i would categorize it in the medium category but for all those who are aware of binary search algo this is a pretty easy question let's try and understand the question let's assume that the value of n that is given to us is 10 in some hypothetical in some hypothetical scenario and this is a range out of which we need to pick an element and let's assume that the number picked happens to be 7 i have lighted number to be 7 here as well now let's start the iteration what we are going to do we'll assign two variables low to the lower end of the range which is 1 high to the higher end of the range which is 10 and now let's calculate the middle element which would be equal to 1 plus 10 by 2, 11 by 2 is 5. So the number that you are guessing happens to be 5. Let's, let me just write guess here as well. What we are going to do, we'll pass in this number to this helper method, which is guess. We'll invoke guess on 5. And which value are we going to return? We'll get the number picked is 7 actually. 7 happens to be higher than your in our guess. This is a case, so this will return positive value 1, that the number is higher than this case. In such cases, we need to truncate the range starting from low up till mid. Because the number will can never lie between 1 to 5, so we have to skip this range. Therefore, we will update low to mid plus 1, which is 6. Let's do, redo for the next iteration. And let me just change the color of pen. Let's take blue. Low plus high is 16. 16 by 2 is 8. So what we are going to do? We'll invoke it on 8. Guess of 8. What guess of 8 will give us? Guess of 8 will give us minus 1. Because the picked number is lower than our guess. So what we are going to do in such cases? we will reduce our, our high end point and that will be reduced to mid minus 1 so what is the value of mid mid happens to be 8 8 minus 1 is 7 so mid gets updated to high gets updated to 7 now let's continue the process a uh, low plus high is 13 13 by 2 is 12 so 12 by 2 is 6 so mid gets updated to 6 let's re-invoke a uh, guess on 6 and what are we going to get this time we'll get that the number picked is lower than your guess we'll get minus 1 in those cases so what we should do we should update low to mid plus 1 which is 7 so this gets updated to 7 and let's perform the last iteration low is 7 high is 7 mid also turns out to be 7 and in the last step we'll invoke guess of 7 guess of 7 will return us 0 because it's a matching case and we found the answer the answer is 7 because in that particular case we'll get 0 from our guess method so as soon as the guess method returns 0 we will return our answer as the guessed value I hope this algo is clear to you. If something is still unclear, don't worry. I'll tell everything in the coding section.
the time complexity of this approach is log n because uh, you are uh, reducing the range in every iteration equals to one high equals to n till the time my low is less than equal to high i identify the middle element we invoke uh, the helper method guess on mid and let's iterate through all the possible values of result if result happens to be zero we return mid as an answer otherwise if result happens to be equal to minus one what we are going to do will update high to mid plus one we are reducing high value high node and otherwise if result happens to be one that means we need to increase the lower bound increasing lower bound or lower node and we update low to mid plus one once we are done with this loop if we there is no such case where we are able to retrieve a result as zero we simply return minus one just for the safety case let's try and submit this accepted and this is slower because of these print statements let's comment them up accepted great so this is 100 percent faster which should have been the case this brings me to the end of today's session i hope you enjoyed it if you did please don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel thanks for viewing it have a great day ahead and stay tuned for more updates from coding decoded i'll see you tomorrow with another fresh question also there is an, an interesting video that is coming up on system design so do give it a shot it premieres tomorrow at 10 am so don't miss it